Thomas, did you want a Coca-Cola? Do you want a Coca-Cola? If you want a Coca-Cola, let me know now before I close the cooler door. Um... Well, look, I've closed the cooler door now, so it's too late. If you want a Coca-Cola, you'll have to get it on your own. Chloe, do you want a Coca-Cola? No, thanks. Right. Darling, darling, what did Mummy tell you? Not with a metal spoon. You'll bruise the dough. <laughs> but it's only panini, Mummy. Now, come on, let's do it properly. Now, are you putting olives in yours? Yes. Right, well, that's fine, but you'll have to wait because there's only one olive fork, because Chloe's using it right now, aren't you, Chloe? Well, actually, no, I'm still waiting for my olives to temper. <laughs> Hello? Hello, Jacques. We're fine. How are you? Yeah. Yeah. No, I don't want to sit down. Just tell me what's happened. Right. Right. Um, listen, Jacques, I'm going to have to call you back. Yes, they're here with me now. No, they're fine. They'll be fine. Yes, thank you, I'm fine. I'll get back to you this afternoon. And Jacques, thank you. I know this wasn't an easy call to make. Thomas. Chloe. I've got something to tell you. You know Daddy left for Paris this morning on business. That was Jacques. Daddy's European PA. I've got some bad news. Daddy hasn't been able to find any good brie this trip. <laughs> <laughs> but, Mummy, it's the school picnic tomorrow. I know, Thomas. Thomas, I know. Has he tried Le Bon Marché? Yes, of course, Chloe. He'll have tried Le Bon Marché first. I think we have some Wensleydale left over from Ginny's christening. Oh, Thomas, don't be silly. It's a Parisian picnic. Do you want all the other children to laugh at you? No. No, of course you don't. Now, come on, children, think. What about Rook 4? That eats well with some good bread. Good, Chloe, that's good. Now, pass Mummy the phone book. Come on, quick sticks. And, Thomas, get me two Nurofen and a glass of Pellegrino. I'm getting one of my heads. <laughs>